great Glenn Campbell song. Let's see what Tower Cameron has to say. Yeah, what's he doing? Our eye in the sky there. I guess he's not saying anything today. He's just playing some rhinestone cowboy. That's fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, oh, wait. There. Oh, there. Fun fact, I'm a licensed <laughs> cowboy. If you need anything wrangled, let me know. Tower Cameron, he's so silly. He's so um, silly, yeah. <laughs> The top bull riders in the world will be in Indy this weekend as part of PBR's Unleash the Beast Tour, which is making a stop at Gamebridge Fieldhouse. That's right. And joining us now, please welcome bull rider Dalton Casehill, who is ranked 11th in the world. Ooh. And you all know the amazing woman sitting next to me. It's Emmy Award winning anchor Fanchon Stinger, who spent more than a decade here with us at Fox 59. She is the founder and CEO of the nonprofit Grit and Grace. Thank you guys so much for being Thank here. You. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to have Cat Dalton Castle with me yeah. as well. Dalton is bringing some of his best bull riding friends to Indianapolis, and they're going to light up Gainbridge Fieldhouse. I love it. it sounds like a really fun Animal. event. I'm excited. Yeah. I love this place. I had good success last year, so hopefully we can keep it rolling. Yeah, Dalton, for people who haven't had a chance to see this sport, what can they expect? You know, it's uh, something that they've never seen before. Uh, I like to say it's kind of like a rock show, but a family-friendly rock show. Okay. Yeah. And it's awesome. You're going to see the top 35 bull riders against the top 35 bulls in the world. Wow. And wow. when I say the world, it's everywhere. Australia, Brazil, Mexico, Canada, wow. the United States. And, and you're ranked 11th in yeah. the world? Yeah. Wow. How Dalton you... posts some of the highest ride numbers in the league. Okay. You know, and when he talks about it, people from all over the world, the PBR is truly inclusive. I mean, yeah. all backgrounds, people coming together. This is truly a family-friendly entertainment. It's the best pyro, like he said, the best bull riders. It's really the best entertainment in sports. I love it. Dalton, how long have you been doing this? I imagine, like, since you could get on a, a horse or a bull or whatever. <laughs> I mean, how long have you been doing it? Yeah, so I started whenever I was 13. Okay. Uh, I got into it. We'd be watching football games, my dad and I, and then bull riding come on TV, and I thought that looked fun. So yeah. I, I just that. did it. Yeah, well, and that's the thing I also love about Fanchin's story. So many people know and love Fanchin here, but then I think a lot of people end up being surprised when they realize that that was such a big part of your upbringing, and now you are the owner of Two Bulls, yeah, yeah. and your nonprofit is yeah. connected with this event. You know, I'll talk about that briefly because bull riding has always been my favorite sport, and I've always wanted to introduce people to it because it's such a special sport. And when I was able to purchase Stinger and Little Hot and become a bull owner, that was not only a dream come true, but I wanted to do something to give back and to make an impact. 43% hmm. of the fan base for PBR is female. Oh, that's wow. a huge deal. 43? So I wouldn't I have was, thought that. That's yes. cool. So Grit and Grace Nation grew out of that. We want it to be an organization that brings people in, introduces them to the sport, yeah. but we also want to be a place where young girls can be equipped with the courage to lead with excellence, not just in Western mm -hmm. sports, but in everything. We reach out to every single zip code, and it really is a metaphor. When you see Dalton and all of his friends get on top of those bulls, and sometimes they get bucked up, you get hurt sometimes. Sometimes it really hurts. Some, sometimes. <laughs> But that's a metaphor for life. Yeah. It is. We want all the young girls to know when life throws you the unexpected, like those bulls throw them the unexpected, mm. they always get back up, mm -hmm. they always get back on, and they always fight for the win. And we want our girls to understand that's how you succeed. Aww. By honoring your values, yeah. honoring our country, honoring faith, family, and freedom. He is a man of strong faith, and he shares, and he's also a dad. And so we can't wait for his little girl to be part of Britain Grace Nation. Oh, that's, that's awesome. amazing. <laughs> yeah, it makes me, having a family and stuff, it makes me uh, appreciate even more what she's, you know, going for and striving in the, that, the stuff that she's came up with yeah. because uh, I want my little girl to pursue it well, in the awesome. same way. I want to give you guys a chance. I know we got about 30 seconds left. I want to talk about the gala happening tonight for Fanchon. Yes. Nonprofit right there. Yes. And then I also want you to maybe take us out with showing us a little something. Yeah, I'll let him do that. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah. He's showing some of that stuff. We're going to be at Lucas Oil Estate tonight, GreenGraceNation.org. But there's a lot when it comes to bull riding, and Dalton brought some of his equipment to show you guys. Okay. 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 Oh, don't worry about that. <laughs> That's fine. fine. So this is the main thing that we hold on to. This is our bull rope, and we this is what we tie ourselves in. And if you don't have this, you can't stay on. How old is that thing? That's got some wear and tear on it. <laughs> yeah, this it's about time for a new one. Okay. <laughs> it's probably been on been 50 holding bulls. On. So. Wow. There you 50 yeah. bulls. Yeah. It, okay. It's been good, so I don't, can't let it go yet. Okay. And I think it's important to say a lot of people are new to bull riding. 
These bulls are not made to buck. They're never mistreated. They're never abused. These bulls are bred to buck, much mm -hmm. like a racehorse. Okay. So when yeah. Dalton gets on top and he's riding his passion, that bull is excited for you to get on there because that bull's doing what it loves. It, exactly. Yeah. yeah. That's that, an important it's part. crazy. They so they have the second highest. It's an ABBI. They have the second highest registered cattle next to Black Angus. Okay. In wow. the yeah. world. And wow. so it has its own, they have their own, you know, certificates and stuff yeah. that they get and their uh, prized possessions in the owner's eyes. Wow. That's right. Well, they're like our children. Yeah. So if you are watching and you don't know bull riding, if you are an animal lover and you care about animal welfare, you need to automatically be a PBR fan. Okay. Yeah. Because PBR is tier one when it comes to caring for animals and honoring not just the bull riders, but honoring the animal athletes. These are Super Bowl athletes. That's great. Wow. We'll check out more information at gritandgracenation.org to learn more about what Fanchon is doing with young women there. And then check that out this weekend at Gamebridge. Go cheer Dalton on. Yes. Guys, thanks so Thank much for being so here. Much. Thank you. Yeah, best yeah, wishes this weekend, it. man. Appreciate it. Thanks for showing us a little something. Thank you. Well, we'll introduce you next to the owner of a new Mexican restaurant on the east side, known for their street corn, fish tacos, and nachos asada. That's right. You know, we'll show you some of the best things that you could check out there. Maybe you want to go there for lunch today. Yeah. We'll be right back.